Hello everyone, um, welcome to a new episode. It's the same day. I'm recording two videos today because for the next two days I'm gonna work non-stop. So we just finished with a draw. We had like 700 ELO performance against 1000, something like that. Um, yeah, let me just show you real quick. A nice... Um, Yeah, a nice continuation. This could be, I should have sacrificed the rook. Um, and obviously if he takes, we have this checkmate. And I should, I should have spot, go to spot that one, but it was just low time. So let's try to play uh, really quickly this time. And I don't, I don't need to overthink, make the first 10 moves uh, and think afterwards, basically. Two knights, this is, hmm, this is quite tricky, but it transposes into the classic, classical line, pretty much. Um, Right, that move screams trouble for me, um, because we have this and this, oh no, we faced this before and it's not good. <clears throat> Him to take, because... Wait, because why exactly? Can I not long? Can I not long castle? Develop here. Take. Develop here. Takes, 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 it's not, it's not good. Develop, takes, take, push. It was really, really bad, man. I'm sure this is not good. I'm sure this is not good. And we faced this before. Um, is this a move? I think this is a move. And takes take. This is a move, but then he can just go back. Maybe I can develop my knight afterwards. I might be walking into a trap. Yeah, I faced this before and it didn't end well. I shouldn't have gone for it because it was two knights. It wasn't a classical variation. I should have thought more, but no, no, I shouldn't have thought more. Let's get the first 10 moves in quickly. Here I'm gonna develop, it's not a problem. Here I can just push a pawn, it should be all right. Obviously if I take the queen, is just checkmate. So I'll have to go here, he's gonna go back. I'm gonna go here. And maybe it's playable. Maybe. He goes there. Is this yet another trick? Does he wants to? Does he want to suck the um, bishop? I'm really confused. If takes takes, hmm, maybe something like this. And takes takes, that's not good. 
So I do have to defend the pawn. If I go with my queen here, it does defend the pawn. Oh boy, this is all prep. He, he can <laughs> very prepared. He knows this variation very well. My opponent from Austria. I thought uh, I'm gonna play another person from Denmark, but it's actually Austria. Okay, finally he's thinking. Thank God. Could maybe play here. It doesn't do much. So I think Fianchetto first is maybe best. Kind of put the put pressure onto the knight. Hmm. It's not easy. It's not easy. I don't want to play b5. So maybe develop the knight, offer a trade. Maybe. Okay, he's out of prep. Good news. Is he gonna castle? Maybe. If he castles, I think I'm better off just ah, but takes, takes, takes. It's really bad. Yeah, this knight is very annoying. What to do, what to do? I'm out of ideas. He castles and brings the rook, that is pretty bad for me. And the main problem is that my king is in the middle of the board still. I'm thinking about these two moves, but it might be too slow. Okay, okay, that's not a problem. Just quick, move quickly, move quickly, move quickly. We don't have time, just move quickly. Hmm, I guess I can. Hmm. I guess I can just develop the knight. Maybe castles. Get out of the pain. He goes there instead, okay. I think I'm okay with this move. Gotta move, move quickly. 15 moves. Gotta make them quickly. And we'll think after. I already was overthinking for quite a few moves. He spent nearly three minutes on on d4. So maybe we could get the advantage on, on time on this one. So just quick, quick. Just play quick. He'll move 20, just quick. As quick as possible, without any blunders, which is a difficult task. <laughs> Anybody can play quick.
You don't want to miss any tactics. I'm not threatening anything, by the way, because if takes, 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 that's perfectly fine for my opponent. Thankfully, this knight cannot easily get in. And I think my king will be pretty safe behind like two bishops. That's really nice, these two snipers. I should just keep them. We don't want to trade the... Uh, uh, okay, that's actually a good move. Okay, am I moving my, my rook here? Takes, 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 like... Fast, quick, don't overthink. Simple moves. Just get castled and play simple moves. But now I notice that this here takes, takes, is, oh, I have my queen here. Um, here takes, yeah, if my queen was not there, this would be, <laughs> okay, I'm noticing some weakness to his king. For now, the bishop is protecting. If I take, he takes back, threatens my knight, and opens his rook. So I must not do that. If he takes, I can take with the queen or the knight. I don't think it matters much. And I'm one move away from castling, which makes me very happy. I sh maybe I could put my rook on the open file. I'm still thinking which of the rooks. Um, must be careful with skewers. If I castle, so let's say I move like that, castles here, and then boom. Just have to be mindful. Hmm. He does have a potential skewer as well. And now we're pretty all right. 13 minutes against nine. Just keep up the pace and I'll be fine. If he takes, I want to take with the knight. Yeah, takes, takes, so wait, takes, 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 pushes, takes, my queen is not defended by the way, so it takes, I cannot uh, take back, so I have to take with the queen, but then here, takes, Takes, takes. Mm. Yeah, I have to take with the queen though. If he takes my knight, I have to take with the queen. These two looks um, central. That would be amazing. My queen is not defended. That is a bit of a problem. Takes, take with a queen. Maybe rook f to e8 would be a good starting move, actually. Actually, without a doubt, without a doubt, and what is he gonna do now? Maybe try to push some pawns, maybe reroute the knight that would be a good idea so that he can push the pawns. 
Okay, he's threatening to take a pawn. We can just push. Actually, think quickly, 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 quickly. Just move quickly. Just quickly, quickly. If he goes here, I'm gonna let him take, and I'll, I'll take back. It's not a problem. Not a problem. Um, so if here, still rook f to e. Um, takes takes. Not a problem. Not a problem. Not a good move. It's not a good move. This is well protected. I can get out of the pin and threaten his bishop at the same time. Multi purpose move. Maybe. Maybe something like takes, takes here. I think he can defend, so. Yeah. If takes, takes. If takes, takes. We should be all right. I'm not a big fan of this. The queen, he can kick my, my knight back. So just bring the rooks, or maybe push. The good part is that my king's pretty safe, and the second good part is that we're 12 minutes against 6. So let's keep let's keep this advantage. Keep the time advantage and make sure you're hydrated. Below six minutes, that's glorious. I don't think my position is that good, but having the time advantage for once, it feels good. Five and a half minutes. If we simplify in the end game, it will be easy for him to <clears throat> right take stakes. Yo, these arrows are junk. Take stakes is not a problem. Okay, think quickly. Just think quickly. This would be pretty nice, but I walk into a pin. That's problem. Or maybe now I can rotate towards his king. Attack him with a tempo. You know what? Just move quickly. Just move quickly. Um, if I go here, this knight will be unprotected. Here, here, here. So obviously it doesn't work, but here. Can the queen make any threats? Just go for it. Who cares about this knight? I have another sneaky threat, because mind you, this is pinned. So if the queen moves, I hope the queen moves here. 
That would be GG, why not? Please move the queen there, I'm begging you. I am begging you. Or there. Please, please, oh lord, please. Please, think that it's a good idea to make a battery. At least, I can get a rook anyway. Yes, yes, my Austrian opponent, please think that make a good idea. Okay, he doesn't think it's a good idea. I can still cash in. On a rook. So let's say maybe check. It's gonna move somewhere. Gonna take. But then he takes and threatens my rook, and it's not very pleasant. But now I can take here, threatening his pawn. Oh yeah, that's the move. This is the move. I can feel it. This is the move. Potentially open. Um, his rook. Alright. Here we go with a sneaky check. Maybe we can even get the queens off the board. Especially... Whoa. Whoa, that was strange. But now I can even play here. Because if takes, takes. That's actually checkmate. Am I hallucinating or something? Bishop here. Bishop here. If takes, takes. Bishop here. He can play here, though. No, that's the problem. Here, 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 yeah, yeah, hmm. Okay, what about this move then? Can obviously just take a free pawn. Take, take. Actually, with this move, with this move, I'm actually threatening checkmate, so. Okay. Can he avoid the queen trade? Can he avoid the queen trade? That is the question. No, no, he cannot. I'm ready to take, ready to attack, attack. Okay, takes, 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 takes. That should be fine. And
rook to the open file should be a good move. I don't think that's a big problem because this is protected. <clears throat> So now I can now I can gang up on the on the bishop, but I could actually start with this move. Let's say something like takes takes massive pressure. Takes takes takes. Ah, he's attacking the rook. Maybe a rook lift. Just a rook lift. Simple. But with a rook lift is there's always this problem. So I think here takes but he has the knight as well. No, but he can never move the knight. So here, here, here. Here, 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 takes, takes, maybe takes, the, the winning move, for sure, for sure, oh, he saw, he saw amazing tactics. He saw my threats. But now I can massively simplify by taking, 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 taking. And really we should. He will have two bishops and my king is rather vulnerable, but... I think takes takes and I can tickle him with a check definitely actually if I take the bishop cannot really move If I could get my king here. X. And my king is paralyzed. That's the problem. But I'm going to push the pawns. I think I'm all right. Bishop here looks really good. Well, I'll push my pawns and bring my my own bishop back, and he resigns. And I do not want a, a rematch. And we are back at fourteen forty seven. Let me just be back in a second with the game review as well. And the game review is back now. We played with an eighty eight point two percent, much better against my opponent. Not much better than my opponent, much better than the previous match of mine. Against my 70, my opponent's 77.3%. Um, no brilliant moves, no blunders, no misses, two mistakes, three inaccuracies. And my opponent was rated maybe after the game 14-19. So we enter into a Kadokan. So far, these are still good moves, but I knew, I knew this was kind of like a trap, trappy line. But I play against this so rarely that I completely forgot. I, I, I reviewed this and I knew about I knew about it. I just didn't remember the queen move. 
like at all. And probably I won't. Next time I'm gonna play against this variation will be after like 50 games or something. So, but here we managed to play the best move because I got the same position and I made a massive blunder here uh, last time. So this one I did remember uh, apparently, but this is the best move. And this is the best move as well. And best move, best move. So actually, I defended quite well. Even though he has a 1.3 advantage. This was all his prep. Alright. The knight out would have been better. Knight out first. Yeah, just the knight out. So I can castle quickly. And uh, now tempoing the bishop would be a good idea. Taking is the best. He didn't take. So I managed to castle. Rook A to D8. Definitely an amazing move. Inaccuracy. Mistake. But I want to find out why. Why is this a mistake? Oh, that's why. But what's going on with the rook move? Could have done that regardless. But anyways, um, yeah, this is a mistake because uh, rook a to d8 is just crushing. Well, I guess it's just a developing move and takes but why can't oh yeah because the knight is guarding oh that's so good yeah i guess you'll have to take and get a free pawn but it's still equal anyways my castle Apparently that's a mistake and this is just good. I thought it was a very good move. And he blunders because of this best move. That's a mistake, but imagine my opponent playing here. Oof, that would have been amazing. I would remember this tactic because I had it happen to me recently, so. Best move, mistake, best move. This is an inaccuracy. This is an inaccuracy. Oh. This was this was even better. Hmm. Interesting. It would have led to mainly the same thing, but so I did play the best move here. This was a nice idea, but it doesn't work. Yeah, because of that as well. But even a crazy move like this, I thought is is completely winning. But I I don't I think not because I'm threatening checkmate. So yeah, it's it's not working because of this move. Pretty much. Mm. And that way I only get like a pawn or something. Actually, I'm down a minor piece. So I correctly just captured the rook. And this is a great move. And this is the best move. Trading the queens. Unavoidable. And again, the best move. And again, the best move. Actually, I did best move again. I played so well, actually. After losing hardcore my previous uh, two games ago and drawing with 50% accuracy, now I'm back to normal. Best move, best move, best move, best move. And best move, actually. 4.9 advantage. I thought for a moment this would be a scary move, but after something like this, I wouldn't 
if I have pushed, I would have just gone here. Maybe I can even sacrifice the rook. I have just too many pawns. But yeah, just simply taking is good enough. And yeah, just after long shuffle. I'm sure I would have uh, got got the job done. Seven, not too bad. Um, yeah, we skipped fifteen, and this one it shows uh, as sixteen, but only because I played after midnight. So it was kind of like yesterday, but after midnight. And these two games, um, a dry in the morning, and the current game right now. This is for tomorrow, and probably I'm gonna record the next uh, episode in 18 of August. You're gonna see this one with a delay, as always, but just so I can make sure that I have constant uploads, um, even when I'm busy. That's it, 1447, we kind of hit a plateau. Um, maybe we can break through, but it's gonna take a while. We need a lot of patience, training, puzzles, and I'm gonna focus more on puzzles and maybe openings. Um, I'll see you tomorrow. Take care of yourselves. Bye bye. Ciao, ciao.